Hello, everyone. Uh, I'm here. Uh, sorry for being late. Uh, I was tired. Uh, but now I should be good. Uh, I don't know why I said I'm tired. I was in traffic. I'm tired too, but I was in traffic. Uh, so that was a whole thing. Hold on. I am just going to screen cap a couple of things. I'm trying to screen cap my settings for previous streams so that I can keep track. Okay. Because I have to adjust a lot of stuff on the fly for these. Uh, like if I do multiplayer stuff, I have to adjust my volume and all that. It, it's a whole thing. But how's everybody doing? Sorry uh, for the wait. I... I am ready. I'm ready for the end of the game. Uh, at least the ending of the pacifist route. Uh, I'm gonna be honest. I am very tempted to do the neutral and genocide route. Uh, Colin, my very good friend who worked on the game, uh, said that he would supply me with a save file for the uh, neutral route so that we wouldn't have to play through the entire game again. Um, before we get into it, uh, a patch for the game dropped today. Literally, uh, I think like two hours before the stream. So I am last minute <laughs> downloading the patch. Uh, so just give me a moment as I uh, figure this whole thing out. In the meantime, though, um, today is a joyous day because today uh, I put out a new comic on Twitter. So if you haven't seen it already and you are a huge Sonic fan like I am, I'm just adjusting the volume. Sorry about that. And you're a huge Sonic fan like I am. Please check it out. Uh, it is a comic about Shadow the Hedgehog. While I figure this out, uh, I'm gonna just put the first page on, uh, on screen. So if you want to see it, it's pinned on my Twitter. So you can find that in the, the description, uh, down below while I f figure out this old patch dealio. God, the music of this game is so good. I love, I love the, the noise. What real is Trevor in it? No, it's... Uh, you guys might not expect this from me, but it's actually a serious project. It's uh, actually a pretty serious project uh, about Shadow the Hedgehog. It's, it's a quick 11-page comic. Shouldn't take you that long to read. I highly suggest it, and, you know, give it a retweet. Give it a repost. Uh, it's on Tumblr, too. Uh, both of them are pinned on my Twitter and Tumblr. Uh, so check it out. Uh, me, Colin, and Claire worked on this together. I wrote, uh, Colin uh, did background art, and Claire did character art. And I think we really, we really killed it on this. So... Highly recommend if you're a big fan of Sonic uh, or if you know the plot of Sonic Adventure 2. It's a little prequel to Sonic Adventure 2 in a lot of ways. Anyway, uh, patch, patch, patch. Sorry, I, I was already late and I'm causing this to be later now because uh, I am struggling. Okay, uh... Ooh, this is a main menu music that I've never heard before. This must be for the the genocide route potentially. Well, I just got spoiled on that, but it's okay. It's just music. Good music, but it's just music. Okay, we have extract holy crud, that's loud. Loud on my end, not for you guys. Um Actually, while this is doing that, I'm going to turn this down. How's everybody doing, though? Uh, today is Friday. Sorry, I am having issues. Uh, I keep misclicking. <laughs> I keep misclicking on stuff. All right. 
I've got it. I've got the new uh, patch running. Let's see if it uh, kept my save file. Oh, it did. Oh, that was easy. That was easy. I don't know where the save file is stored, but it 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 got my save file. All right. So we're ready to go. Uh, like I said last time, uh, or like I said before, if you want to check out uh, the comic, uh, it is pinned on my Twitter and Tumblr. Uh, I'd really appreciate it if more people checked it out. We really worked super hard on this, uh, and uh, I'm very happy with how it came out. And, you know, if, you know, it, it gets support and uh, gets reposted and, you know, goes around a bit more. I'd love to do more stuff like it. I know it's not the standard. Uh, ooh, uh, freaking funny. This is so funny. But uh, I do really like writing and I like working on projects like this, like comics and, you know, little projects. Uh, and I'd love to work on bigger ones someday. But for now, it's just the small stuff. Uh, and I really, really appreciate all the support. But anyway. Sorry about that. Sorry about the shameless self-promotion. Uh, we are going to start the game now. Yo, shout out to the comment that says, Are you going to show the game? I do whatever I want. Go. Oh, <laughs> listen. Listen. You can go anywhere else for Undertale Yellow gameplay. There's plenty. There is plenty of people playing this game. You don't have to be here. It's okay. If you don't care about my, my stupid little projects, don't worry about it. You can go someplace else. It's all good, but I'm going to shill them. Um, here we go. This should be it. There we go. All right. We're back in it. How we doing on uh, audio? We good on audio? Make sure the levels are good. Yeah, I was gonna say, if 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 you if you are pissed that I'm not playing through Undertale Yellow fast enough, here's a crazy thing about this game: it's free. You can download it right now. You can do it. You have. You have. Uh, poten you have the potential to do it. I think you. <laughs> wait, what does this comment say? Salty DK Dan, I think you might be my long lost brother. I remember us picking apples together in <laughs> Papa's Orchard upon a summer eve. Quinn. I don't. I don't have a, I don't have a, uh, I don't have a long lost brother or sister or person, uh, whoever you are. I, I don't, I don't know your pronouns. I, I'm not your long lost sibling. <laughs> I feel like, I feel like that's completely, that's completely, uh, somebody else. And I apologize and I, I wish you well, but that's not me. Yeah, I know. Shocker, you can be your own person. Guys, I don't want to put on the Bob's Burgers cam at the end of the game. It's starting to get really serious now. Why would I completely ruin this by, like, adding Bob's Burgers and role-playing as Bob's Burgers? I'm not going to do it. Time for the ending of this game. I'm really liking this game so far. S Salty, is this a game that you can get spoilers on? Uh, yeah. It's a very story-heavy game, so, like, if, if, okay. Full disclosure, if you don't want to be spoiled on the end of the game, leave the stream now. Leave the stream now and go play the game for yourself. I highly recommend it. It's been amazing so far. But just do that for yourself because I'm going to be real with you. Uh, I'm not spoiled on the end of this game and I'm very excited 
because it's built up some really good stuff so far. My favorite character in this is uh is North Star. I really like North Star. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Can you, can you imagine? Can you imagine what's about to happen? I, I don't even know. I, I don't even. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wow. <laughs> I can't. No, I can't do it. I can't. I, I was gonna try. Sorry, guys. I can't. I can't ruin the end of the game. I, I'm too excited. I don't want to do it. <laughs> I, I don't want to do it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I can't give it up. <laughs> I wish Chujin invited me back in the day. This house is incredible. Uh, yeah, let's get inside and see what the fuss is about. I can only imagine how this game is going to end. All I know is that for sure, for sure, uh, Clover's going to have to die. Oh, wait, Bob. Oh, wait, somebody wants a recap from Bob. Okay, got it. Okay, so basically Undertale Yellow is a, is a prequel of Undertale. Uh, where you play as the yellow soul uh and uh it's a fan game where uh the yellow soul is reimagined uh into uh, a cowboy type human character uh and uh they fall into to the underground uh and uh basically oh wait sorry basically <laughs> and let me tell you it's crazy um uh, you you meet a bunch of uh, monsters from uh, from the underground that aren't in the original game, but they're completely new. Uh, they help recontextualize the story of the original Undertale in a really fun and unique way. Uh, Gene was telling me about this game before I played it, and it's very good. Uh, so uh, definitely check it out if you haven't already. Uh, I can't really recap. Uh, the entire story kind of defeats the purpose of the Let's Play. Uh, just go watch the other streams if, if you need a recap proper. That's really all I can say. Okay, I hope that I hope I hope that helps. <laughs> Who up here, Bob and they bird? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I should have asked where the papers and tapes are located, huh? Hmm. I guess we can take a look around. Should be an office somewhere. Go back for Blimbino? Dude, I don't think that Blimbino is around. Oh, wow. Oh, it's like very, uh... Oh my god, what what is this inspired by? Is it like a, like a Japanese sort of uh, architecture? Like, just Eastern architecture in general? Probably? I don't know. I don't know, like, what this style of house is called. Uh, you stare at the reflection in the sink water. The many trials you've endured have taken their toll on your appearance. <laughs> you stared in the sink water. Despite everything, it's still you. The Founder's Crest. Decisive, devoted, determined. Oh, she left her fire on. The fireplace is making the already warm house warmer. Pretty counterproductive in a climate like this. Still, it looks beautiful. The founder's crest. Ooh. Well, this is definitely Chujin's uh, workbench. And the music stopped, so I feel like this is an important room. I'm going to come back. Ooh. Several building bricks are scattered around a stuffed animal. Almost looks like it's watching me. Not sure I like this room. Ooh, also, uh, before I forget, uh, check out the GoFundMe in the description. A mutual of mine, uh, their father had a stroke and they're trying to move from uh, state to state. And it requires a bit extra money, so if you were going to throw any money at me today, throw some money at them. Uh, I'm working on an extensive uh, funding goal thing for uh, for this GoFundMe and Pasty's GoFundMe from yesterday. Uh, and 
It, let me tell you, I have some, I have some interesting funding goals. Like a specific, have you heard about that people, uh, people have been asking me for, uh, if, if we reach the funding goal for both. Specifically pasties, because, you know, like, it's related to pasty. And I think that people would really want, uh, this have you heard about. So we shall see. I don't think we need to look in there. The sturdy bed sits uh, bathing in the warm glow of the dunes. What a what a masterwork, hand carved and everything. It's hard to believe Chujin had the time to craft all of this. Are you gonna be doing a genocide run? Um, uh, I'm I was on the fence, but like the more I play of this, the more I'm like, yeah, I think I'm gonna do the genocide run. An old TV game and console gathering dust. The game case has a handmade cover slip. Surface Tycoon, it says. Chujin programmed a video game for Kanako? Wow. It must have been awesome to have him as a dad. Also, is that a drawing of Dalv up there? I can't really... S like, it, it seems pixelated, but yeah. Also, that's a drawing of uh, Kanako uh, and the whole family. Interesting. Also, that's a Wii! I, I can play the Smash Bros on that. I'm just going to quickly run over here. Open the drawer. Nothing but old pens. That's locked. Okay. I know where we're going then. The cabinet contains thesis papers on many different subjects. Whoa, these are all typed on cardstock. How wealthy was Chujin? Uh, also, I'm just now realizing uh, this room, when I went into it before, the music stopped. But now it's still going. So I'm wondering if that's on purpose or not. I don't know. Uh, expertly organized files labeled with numerous monster names. Uh, did he keep records of everyone he befriended? Sandra, Lewis, Dr. Fish, Rosa, Marley. Wait, Marley? He... He found another monster with my name? I can't believe that never came up. That is interesting. And also, that, that kind of like... Hold on. So, he, he kept... He kept files on all of the monsters he befriended? A part of that gives me the, the kind of vibes of like, you know, like pacifism in the game like like maybe there's something with pacifism i don't know I, i'm reading into this but you know it's meant to be read into a bit gizmos and gadgets fill the desk place looming over it all a map on the map are several pin locations of this isn't what ed was talking about right i mean this is clearly chujin's office but I wouldn't say it's strange to keep track of where humans... Uh, sorry, I'm sure this is upsetting to look at. Still, many monsters do keep up with it. Those events are a big deal down here. Yeah, it's, I, I don't know. A few unfinished robots poke out from the box. Huh. I heard about Chujin's interest in robotics once. I guess this is as far as he ever got? Drawer full of videotapes. A label in on a label on front reads home movies. Uh, home movies, you say? Home movies. I I love home movies. That's awesome. While I'm sure these are adorable, we don't have the time to watch them. We gotta keep looking for whatever spooked dead and star. Is it not in here? That's shocking. Also, yeah, if you look up on the map, the, the colors of the other human souls are on the map. So I'm wondering, is that a map or is it like it's some kind of diagram? Interesting. OK, well, that's not. Oh, here we go. This is a new little area. Wait, what did that say? Hold on, I didn't even clock that. The Founder's Crest. 
decisive, devoted, determined. Determined, determination. The fireplace is making uh, already warm house warmer. That, what's that on the top of the fireplace? Is that like to hold something? Does this not go anywhere? That's strange. I thought this would be like a door to an area or something. You open the refrigerator and find some leftover corn chowder. Oh, hell yeah. You that hungry? Um, all right then. I suppose she won't miss it, right? You got some corn chowder. Oh, let's go. Give me that flavor text. Corn chowder heals 15 HP. Weeks old leftovers from Soroba's fridge. Awesome. Ooh, new area. The bed is tidily made. Doesn't look like it's been used in a long time. Whoa! Oh, wait, this is the first time that we're seeing Chujin. Oh my gosh, okay. Um, wait a second. Wait a second. That thing above the fireplace. That little mount that didn't have anything on it from before. That's where the mask goes. Maybe we need to find the mask and then put it on the mount. Or I'm overthinking this, and it's a very small detail. We got, oh man, look at this cute family photo. Too bad, like, two of these guys are probably dead. I can't stand looking at that. It's... Let's just move on. You search the nightstand. You find a folded up PSA, which you stash in your mailbag. Soroba's many outfits hang in the closet. You can see someone else's clothes hidden uh, in the behind the front row. Soroba knows what she likes, huh? Usually I'd be envious of such intense resolve, but I'm not so sure it's a good trade anymore. Okay, nothing else in here. You open the drawer. It's empty. Okay, I can search the drawers. The door is locked from the other side. Ah, locked, huh? Strange. Guess Ed and Star took another route. I'm starting to think that I need that mask. Nothing in, in it but in a, old pencils. Hold on, can I... I thought I could interact with those pictures for a moment. Just kidding. Just some knickknacks in various shapes and sizes. Hold on, uh, mail PSA. Dear citizens of the underground, we are calling for fallen down monsters to be sent to Hotland for important scientific research. Should you choose to participate, your loved ones will be treated with utmost respect, their condition heavily monitored, and you regularly notified of their status. This is a chance for tragedy to be turned into opportunity, for monster kind to finally see the light of the surface thanks to its citizens' invaluable bravery and sacrifice. For your consideration, Royal Science Division. This is a haunting letter, knowing about the lab from Undertale. This is a horrifying letter. Okay, so I'm thinking... I could be wrong, but I'm thinking that this mount right here, I put, the, I put a mask on it. I just need to find where said mask is. Uh, pardon me, blah, blah, blah. Nuh-uh. Kids shouldn't miss, <laughs> mess with knives. Kids shouldn't mess with guns either. I think I might be guilty of child endangerment. Table? Somebody said table. Hold on. Yeah, table doesn't do anything. Hold on. Yeah, the, the, the mat, the mat is like turned up a little bit. Hold on. This must have been where they ate their meals. I was right. I was right. Okay. Yeah. Uh, 
What, what do you see? It's very subtle, but yeah, the, the, the mat was turned up a little bit. I didn't, I didn't realize. Hey, uh, I need your help. Wait, somebody said, check discord. Colin sent you something. Uh, before I forget, I don't know if you'll see this, but you can sell that necklace and blackjacks, uh, at the, sh at, at blackjack shop for more money. It's not important. Just <laughs> don't tell anyone <laughs> I told you. I shouldn't have read that out loud. Whoops. Colin, maybe you should have started with that. Maybe, <laughs> maybe you should have put it. Maybe you should have put that at top. Don't say this on stream. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Colin. <laughs> Man, I really got to stop reading stuff out loud, like immediately. Oh my God. My bad. <laughs> <laughs> Colin being like, hey, dude, here are the missile launch codes. Uh, don't tell anybody what these launch codes are, and I've already fully read them out. I need your help. You think something's under there? All right, then. I didn't mean it like that. You're good. Okay, thank God. <laughs> On three. One, two, three. Whoa. Good eye, Clover. Wait, should I go back and sell it now, or when I'm on my way back? Spooky. Well, uh, after you. Uh, okay. I guess I'm going in. This is so eerie. Oh my, what, what is all of this? It's a secret lab. Formulas, soul research. Hold on, look over here. Tapes. Each one has a date on it. Y you know, maybe this is all a big misunderstanding. Yeah, that's probably it. We'll just watch these and clear the air. Uh, it's about to hit the fan. I know it. When my when my wife wants to watch blue, but I want to watch orange. Greetings. This is Chujin. I don't have much time these days for a written journal, so I opted for a video. I have no idea who will view these, if anyone. But I see it as the best way to document my work. That is all for now. Signing off. This is Chujin. Today, I traveled to Snowden with my daughter on casual business. While I was busy, Kaneko wandered off to play with a resident. That's when it happened. A few panicked townsfolk ran up to me saying that a human had entered the area. This human. They attacked the monster Kaneko was, it, was with. She was so close. She could have been next. No one was there to protect her. Not even me. I don't understand. I just don't understand! Humankind already won by trapping us down here, yet they keep twisting the knife! This cannot continue any longer. As of today, I'm looking into stopping this perpetual injustice, once and for all. This is Chujin, with unfortunate news. I was fired from my engineering position. I poured my all into working my project, but it wasn't enough. The programming was buggy, but 
I knew I could have ironed it out with a few more iterations. Why am I punished for trying to take our struggle seriously? Neil is still I'm the only one who hasn't forgotten or chosen to live in ignorance. I told Saroba I was retiring. Can't let her think less of me. But enough of that. It's in the past. I must live in the present and plan for the future. Prove I can save monster kind another way. This is Chujin. After years of research, I've made a breakthrough. Boss monsters. They may be the con they may be the key to monster kind survival. I was able to reach this conclusion because I uh, I carry the boss monster gene. This means that my soul is much stronger than that of other monsters. More importantly, boss monsters are immortal until they produce offspring. Right now, monster kind is few in numbers compared to humanity, but uh, what if anyone could become a boss monster like me? Like Kaneko? As a nation, an army, we could finally possess enough power to take the surface back. My theory for this involves the fusion of a human soul and a boss monster soul. From that, a serum would be extracted, which could transform any average monster. Unfortunately, I've not gathered enough proof that said serum is even possible. I must conduct more tests. This is... This is Chujin. I was... Worried this might happen. Science is a dangerous game. Rather foolishly, I experimented on myself. Several times. Over and over, the subject rejected the fusion. And I think I know why. I'll be direct. My soul has deteriorated, and I don't know how much longer I have. However, I believe that my theory holds stronger than it ever did. This is a message to my dear Saroba. Please, this research is up to you. No one else would listen. After I'm gone, look for the next human who falls down here. Someone pure of heart. Uncorrupted. I need you to obtain their soul, but not just anywhere. You must have a boss monster soul nearby to fuse with. You'll need... Damn it all. Search for a willing boss monster in the underground. Someone... else. Please. Our little girl, Kanako. She needs to live a happy life, unaffected by my endeavors. That is my final wish. I hate this channel. <laughs> hey guys, this is a, this is a, this is a really good time to tell you guys that I started watching Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. No particular reason, I guess. I, I just got a couple episodes in. Been really liking it so far. Pretty good. Pretty good show. Anyway, back to the game. Oh. Oh my gosh. I... I never knew he... He, he never mentioned... Clover, we have to go. Right now. Come on. Uh, 
I was I was not joking about that, by the way. I I literally have just started watching Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood, and I did get to that episode. <laughs> so, wow, what timing, huh? Woo! <laughs> uh, uh, sorry, I'm just so excited. I'm uh, so. Uh, I gotta figure out a voice for this guy. So, you figured it out? Yes. Sarova was trying to carry out a plan that Chujin left for her. Something involving Clover's soul and a boss monster soul? Which happens to reside in Kaneko. Yep. Uh, this is not, this is not good. What the? So she lied to us? About the mission to retrieve Kaneko? She wasn't lying about finding Kaneko. That's the alarming part. So, Kaneko is alive and well? Thank goodness. Alive? I am I missing something? It's a... It's a long story. She fell down some time ago. So, Robert sent her to the lab and hopes to remedy the situation. I... I had no idea. Okay, where was the last place you saw Saroba go, Ed? You ain't taking Clover straight to her, are you? That's exactly what she wants, right? Yeah, Clover needs to stay safe with us. She can't accomplish her goal if Clover's nowhere to be found. We aren't going to let her accomplish her goal. In any way... The Wild East is a tourist destination, a public place. My colleagues probably know a human is in the underground by now. If Clover stayed here, they would eventually tear the town up. Better to be on the move, yeah? I, uh... Look, I need to fly ahead to scout out the situation. So, again, where did the two go? I don't think- Clover! <laughs> uh, I don't think, uh, Clover, you were there. Where did they go? The lab, most likely. <laughs> that lines up. Hot land it is. Hey, I gave Star my word. I'll let them do it, Ed. Clover is the only one who can put this to rest. Duh, okay. <laughs> They took the westmost elevator in the steamworks. You can use a laundry chute to get there quicker. That elevator's destination sits near the core. Ask around if someone has spotted which direction they went from there. Uh, wait, we need to go too, right? You need all the help you can get. Uh, appreciate the offer, but please don't. This might get dangerous. Stay here and keep the townsfolk happy, like you always have. Uh, okay, but please be safe. I'll try. Thanks for all of your help. Even if you locked me in jail- Even if you locked me in a jail cell for hours on end. Hey, what are friends for? <laughs> I can't think of a few things. Yeah, I mean, yeah, no problem. Clover, meet me on the rooftop of UG Apartments ASAP. We'll figure this out, I, I promise. Alright. I, uh, wish you luck with this. Uh, seriously. Yeah, I bet we'll all be catching bandits again shortly. I, I, I had really bad inflection on that line. I think it's supposed to be read more like, yeah, I'm sure we'll be catching bandits again shortly. Like something like that. I'll be sure to save you a spot at our next nap time. Oh, they call it nap time? Man, I love these cowboy rejects. Uh, just don't do anything stupid. Uh, see you later, deputy. If you go around the left side of the house uh, area, uh, there's a hidden secret. Is there a hidden secret? Well, I guess we're gonna find out. No, Clover, Clover, let me sp let me walk. Howdy! Long time no see, buddy. 
I've been, uh, wanting to tell you something. It's been weighing on my mind, so I truly mean it when I say, Told you so. <laughs> Sorry, couldn't pass that up. Now, I know this is the part where I tell you to ignore Saroba, but, uh, I have a strong feeling that wouldn't sway you at this point. Honestly, I'm starting to see... I'm starting to want to see this play out. After all, that fox wants to waste your soul on a science fair project. No good. I'm in your corner, like, all, like I've always been, so don't worry. We'll get rid of her and continue down our path. Easy peasy. It'll all work out in the end, pal. Let me see, uh, what, what's, uh... Ooh, there's a little path. Uh, this is really... F this does not seem like a small secret. I don't know what this is. Is this Chujin's grave? Oh my god, it's Chujin's grave! Dude, what? The best of us. Wow, and oh my god, the sprite work in this area is crazy. What? Dude, look at the gradients and the shading and the shadows and crap. Oh my god. Wow, this is nuts. Check behind the gravestone. You notice a subtle indentation in the dirt behind the gravestone. Inspect further. You dig into the ground with your hands until you hit something solid. Am I, <laughs> am I just unearthing this dude's corpse? Oh, it's a video. T Wait, what? It's a videotape with a blank label. Take it. Yes. Hold the fucking phone. What? Wait, can I play this? Oh, my God. What is this? Hold the phone. Quite the turn of events, huh? Well, good thing I'm on the winning side. <laughs> I'll bet you'll handle Saroba like it's nothing. Also, I noticed this door is locked from the other side. This door is still locked. Hold on. I... Maybe I can play this tape on the thing in the basement? I'm going to try this one more time. Nope. Doesn't open. You load the mysterious tape into the slot underneath the screen. Dude, what? What could even be on this? This is Chujin. I messed up. Miscalculated something. Axis. Axis is dangerous. I must have overshot the variables. All I wanted was apprehension. The human who almost hurt my child? I told Axis to track them down. I know, I should have stayed to comfort Kaneko and, and tend to the resident who was hurt, but... I had a tool that could stop the human's crusade. So I tried. In a flash, Axis left me, bolted for Waterfall. By the time I tracked him down, it was too late. I will never forget the scene that laid before me. Part of me wanted to quit everything in that instant, but this outcome was earned, was it not? Axis soon contained the subject and uh, hid the evidence. There was some property damage, but I'm sure it won't come back to me. I hope. In any case, I now have a human soul in my possession. I do not know exactly what I should do with it, but the power that rests within is... Well, let's just say I'm not donating I'm not donating it to Asgore like all the others. 
Not yet. As for Axis, today's actions were excessive, but the potential is outstanding. With more work, Axis can be the future. I'm sure of it. Anyway, I need to sleep. Though something tells me that'll be difficult to do for a while. Dude, Axis obliterated a child. Axis murked a kid. Yo, where the soul at? Where the human soul at? Where the human soul at? I want it. I want it. So, okay. So what this, what this means to me, at least to me, if I'm thinking about this, um, it seems to me, uh, potentially there was another human that isn't counted as one of the other colored souls that like came down here. And that was the, that was the soul that Chujin got. I don't think that that soul actually eventually got sent to Asgore. I think that something happened to it or whatever. I, I don't know. Uh, unless I'm, unless I'm misconstruing this, I bet Axis has the soul, which is why killing him gives XP. I didn't know that killing him gave XP. Slight spoiler, but you know what? That, mm, that might, that might add up. It was the blue soul. How do you, wait, how do you know that it was the blue soul though? It'll be explained later. Okay, then I'll just, I'll just let the game, I'll let the game do its thing. So where, where did she say, uh, Marley say that she was going to be? Yeah, I gotta go sell the necklace. You killed Axis? No, I didn't kill Axis. I, I, I've been, I've been pacifying everything. Pacifist, baby. I am interested in what this area is. Uh, but I guess we'll find that out later. You know what the elevator at the end of- You know that elevator at the end of the Steamworks? I believe it's your ticket. Let's deal with that backstabber already. Okay, let me turn uh, down the music just a little bit. Okay. Go to Steamworks, close chute on the left. Well, hold on, let me sell my crap first. What did Colin say? Um, you could sell the necklace. You could sell the necklace at the black shop shop for more money. Okie doke. I think I sold the necklace. Oh no, I didn't. It's already in my inventory. Okay. Uh, what about the feather? Can I sell the feather? Is that, ne is that needed for something? Oh, is that what that map was communicating? That like, the, the souls were in different locations of the underground? Is this game inspired by Undertale? <laughs> no, dude, that chat message is killing me. What? <laughs> no, no, there's, no, this isn't related to Undertale at all. Um, okay, I need healing items. All right, um, ice water, root beer, feisty slider. 
a root beer. There's a shop at MTT. Okay, then I, I won't. Oh shit, I forgot to check for white guy. Okay, so in between streams, in between streams, I actually found this out. Apparently that white guy that's on stage that you can interact with that we only saw once, that is a fun value event. And according to Colin, I was one of the first people to play this game to get that event. Apparently no one on the dev team has seen really anybody get that yet except for me. I feel so honored when that happened. I could be completely wrong, but uh, I'm going to say I, I that's that's my thing now. I find white people. Um wait, where did Okay, so Marley said Hey, I also encountered the white guy in Snowden on my first playthrough too. Well, which white guy? The, is it the same white guy? I don't think it's the same white guy. Because there was a white guy in Snowden, but it wasn't the same guy. At least publicly on stream, Colin says I was the first one that they saw. But also, where the frick is Marley? I forget. I forget where she said. She said she was on top of a hotel. Well, actually, that reminds me. Uh... Yes, give me a boost, please. Use fast travel to the Steamworks. Oh yeah, I can do that. Okay, where's a... I need to find a fast travel location. Well, uh, I think I went a little bit too far. I don't think that there's a fast travel location here. Oh, wait, there actually might be one right up ahead. Yeah, let's go. Hello, greetings, hip hip hooray. What can I do for you today? Uh, travel. Uh, steam works. Steamworks C Station. I think it's C Station? Up on my fucking back and we'll go wherever. Oh, that's a cute little sprite. Arrived without a scratch. The journey was fun, but it's time to dispatch. Just ring the bell for any further assistance. The UGPS will be there with a little resistance. With little resistance, not a little resistance. He shows up and he's like, fuck off. You know, the elevator, blah, blah, blah. I know, bro. I know. Don't worry. There we go. That's the laundry chute. Return to the laundry room? Yes. Oh no, it just brings me down here. Oh no, wait, I want to go back up. Climb to the top? Yeah. You never bought out Mo? Yeah, I did. Were you not paying attention? I went back and I, I bought all of his stuff. Okay, yeah, here is the elevator. Ooh, is that the Hotland music? It's the Hotland music! Oh my god. 
Dude, ooh, this is looking familiar. This this le map layout's looking a bit familiar. Bro, I came to the club to let loose and boogie, not wait in line. It's crab hour is what they keep telling me. It's crab hour. I'm not sure I meet the requirements to set foot in the club. My age isn't a problem. It's that I never get my dancers li I never got my dancers last. Done to Dude, is that Flames McHot guy? Come on, I gotta be on the guest list. Everybody knows my name. Anytime now, anytime now, the bouncer's memory of me will come ba rushing back. Surprised it's not, it's taking this long. Oi, if you want to go into the club, you're gonna have to wait in line. That is, unless you're on the VIP guest list. I doubt it, but it wouldn't hurt to check. But you look at that, I got a lad here that looks just like you. Go on, then. Oh, wow, you just go. Dude, it's El Balador! Ah, oh, it is you. Welcome to my club. I'm glad you remembered to put on to. I'm glad I remembered to put you on the guest list. Now join us in a dance, will you? Oh, right, I forgot. You're not big on dancing. More of a sentinel of silence, right? Funny history I have with those folk. We all used to live on the top floor of UG Apartments north of here. Our side of the hall wanted to be bold, high energy. While the other preferred the deafening sound of silence. We feuded over the SVL for weeks. The standard volume level, that is. Long story short, we all were kicked out. Ha <laughs> ha! Gone our separate ways now. Free to chase any comfort we choose. I sometimes wonder what that bat got up to. Probably lives in some Snowden cave. If I were you, I would let loose and dance with us. One never knows when they dance their last. These like, what? There's a lot of different crabs. Oh wait, no, it's crab time. <laughs> Moves are so hot, my worries are melting away. <laughs> getting down, getting down. <laughs> Smooth with it. <laughs> <laughs> I freaking suck at dancing. Hold on, wait. I don't want to go here yet. I want to go back just in case. Guys, I think this is an Undertale clone. Oh, do you guys think? You think so? Oh, I didn't even have to go down there. Okay. Okay, that's MTT. I'm gonna get this location real quick. Stand still on the dance tiles? Wait. Oh, I got mail though. Hold on. Yo! Yo! He's smooth with it! Yo! Dude, he's going nuts! Somebody call 911. This dude, this dude is on fire on the dance floor. Man, I love that. <laughs> That's great. Hey, uh, you caught me chilling by my brand new house. That's right. Just bought this sucker. I've been down in the dumps lately, so I thought it was time to move on. Do something nice for myself, you know? Well, I highly recommend doing something nice for yourself every now and again. It's therapeutic. Can't let anyone inside yet. Got a crew doing renovations. They're installing the latest music production equipment. Fancy stuff. Let's just say you're gonna start hearing my hot beats everywhere. Wasn't this the guy that was like in tears? Whatever your struggle, just hold on tight. Life gets better. Yeah, this is definitely the guy. It's locked. Must music producers only. <laughs> what is going on here? Uh, uh, no can do. Our citizens aren't allowed past this point. We're currently under heavy spider construction, as you can see. 
A ain't set to finish until 20xx or so. A mighty roadblock stands in the way. This is great. <laughs> this is awesome. All right. Time to go to MTT. Anything over here? Anything over here? Oh, yep. Wait, what? Sw the swimming pool of champions. You discover some monster candy in the trash can. It's butterscotch flavored. Take it. You got monster candy. There's a note on the door. Stranger, please stop eating the cat food I leave out. It's for stray. It's for a stray who's stuck in here with us. Not for monsters. Thank you. Who knows what might happen from this point forward? Continue. Uh, turn, turn back. Yeah, turn back. Wait, what? Ooh. Sorry, UG Apartments, not MTT. My bad. Yeah, that, that story stuff. I'm going in here. Thank God that they had a, a little pop-up to tell me that, that that was story stuff. I didn't realize. Oh, uh, howdy. Uh, we're nearing the castle now. Uh, what an eventful day. For kicks and giggles, why don't we tally up our death total? <laughs> Drum roll, please. <laughs> you died four times! Wow! If I wasn't here to help, this all would have been a disaster. Maybe jumping down a chasm gung-ho wasn't the brightest idea. But hey, all's well that ends well. <laughs> what is this guy? You know that UGPS station right outside? Wait. That's his head? What? I hear it's gonna be removed soon. All of them, in fact. You might think it's because letters are going out of style, but, uh, nah. The company is just switching up their business model. Direct delivery to citizens' mailboxes from now on. Convenient, but kind of bittersweet. I enjoyed my daily walks to the old station. At least this means that everybody keeps their jobs. <laughs> That's good news. I also just noticed this. There's an inscription on the fountain. Hopes and dreams. Built 21X. Hear a faint melody coming from the statue. So this, okay. This is really interesting. So if anybody has played the original Undertale, you would know that this statue is not in this area normally. It, it's a statue of Metaton. Um, this statue can be found elsewhere in the underground, and it's kind of a little out of place thing in the underground. Uh, and it seems to me that when Metaton moved in, he moved this statue. And I think that this statue is supposed to be representative of like Azriel, maybe in like a memorial kind of. So I find that pretty interesting. And it also kind of showcases how Metaton is very like self-absorbent uh, and just was like, uh, this looks stupid. Put up my statue instead. I'm usually a chill dude, but today has not been my day. Let me tell you. First, the attached, the attendant needs my name so she could save me a room. Mr. Mr. Cursor, I reply. She steps back and goes like, uh, like some kind of warlock. I say, what? Warlock? With visible confusion. I like to roll that 10 sided die as much as the next guy, but no, I missed her cursor. Turns out she thought I said cursor, like I was going to hex the joint. I really didn't need her input on my iconic name, but whatever. So then I walk over to the elevator to head back to new home. It's busy, so I wait and I wait and I wait and literally three hours pass. Next thing I know, the elevator pops open, but oops. Mr. Cursor has a tendency to time out and fall asleep every five minutes. So I missed my one chance. And now I'm stuck here and I don't know when I'll ever- Go home! <laughs> That's a great joke. 
Bits, bits and bites. Who the hell is this? <laughs> well, welcome to Bits and Bites. Uh, buy something, will you? Monster candy, uh, highly addictive. CB strudel, uh, heals 30 HP, a taste fit for a king. Floral cupcake uh, made with extra flour. Uh, ooh, Delta Rune Patch. Dude, oh my god, this item references Simpsons Hit and Run. Like Delta Rune, Delta Rune, like Simpsons Hit and Run. Uh, Asgore. Mr. Fluffy Buns is the shiny beacon of our nation. One of the main reasons we're so close to breaking the barrier and moving back up to the surface. Yeah, he's great at sticking it to humans. Hey now, Asgore carries a huge weight on his shoulders, you know? Having to deal with all the unpleasantries that come with harvesting human souls? Isn't that a fun job? Handles like a champ, though. I wouldn't choose anyone else to lead us into a brighter future. Jeez, if you like him so much, why don't you marry the guy? Oh, you know I would if I could. Hotland. It's a stretch of of land which happens to be hot. Done. Area explained. Uh, you're doing it a disservice to the rich history of Hotland has to offer. It's got a rich history, all right. Costs a fortune to build the place. <laughs> But for a good reason. There are many impressive landmarks here in the like the lab, the spider house, UG apartments, elevators, one through seven, conveyor belts, rocks. It's a stretch of land which happens to be hot. Ah, uh, yep. The sock. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa, hey! Wind me up, Pits! Wind me up right now! Uh, excuse me, patron, but Buttons doesn't appreciate that word. It's not considered very nice where he comes from. Take your filthy mouth out to the dump where it belongs, and I'll shut you right up here and now, you expressionless infant! Now, Buttons, we talked about this. Finish the phrase, we don't punch who hath punched. I know, I know. We're working on Buttons' anger management. It's a slow process, but I think you'll get better sooner or later. I don't see what's so wrong with unleashing rage upon my enemies. I, I honestly don't. It's simple. Being kind to others leads to more profits in the shop. Hmm, maybe I could try a little harder. You're right. Toriel? Oh, um, <laughs> uh, That's a rather sensitive subject. I don't really know. Toriel divorced the king! Hilarious! Buttons, the disrespect! If the man's not right, the man's not right! <laughs> oh, you're such a handful. Am I right? Get it? Stop speaking! Uh, sorry. Okay, hold on. Uh, exit. Why is this design so good? Yeah, it's a pretty well-designed character. And I also just noticed that the character is standing on, like, the table next to the catch register. Like, that's their little booties. Thanks for your time! Don't let the door hit you on the way out! Okay, a uh, Delta Rune Patch. Uh, Delta Rune Patch. Armored Defense 10. The Kingdom of Monsters Official Insignia. You attach the patch to your vest and you begin to feel something. The unwavering hopes and dreams of monster kind. Looking good. Safety goggles. Um. Dun, dun. Salty, you never visited Dalvin Snowden. I did not. You are correct. Starlo, urgent. Wait, star like like North Star Starlo? Hey, Clover, something's up. Uh, I made up with the posse as planned. All was going well, but then I began worrying about you and Saroba. Oh, this is from before uh, when Saroba, uh, when he went with Saroba. I thought it was after. 
Uh, that's when I got the idea to break into Soroba's old house and spruce it up and celebrate her and Kaneko's eventual return. Well, uh, when Ed was sweeping around, he found some kind of secret room. Sounds like it belonged- seems like it belongs to Chujin. We didn't have the time to dig into its, its content, but all I know is it worried us both. You may be in danger. Then again, maybe not. Uh, just come back to the Wild East for now. I can only hope this letter reaches you in time. It did not. <laughs> Slurpy letter two. Hello again, dear comrade. I hope this letter finds you in a very picture of health. I heard word that you were venturing near the vicinity of Hotland. Being that the resting temperature in that region is so high, I have concluded one premium Snowden Snowfear. I hope that it keeps you at an ideal temperature throughout your journey. Next time you're at Snowden, feel free to drop in. Mother will surely prepare you a, pl a palatable meal. Sincerely yours, Slurpy. The letter and envelope are very wet. A uh, mail? I can't read this. Axis. <laughs> okay, thanks, Axis. Somebody put this through like a a, a binary thing. I 100%, 100%. If you put this through like a, a binary like code thing, uh, I feel like this is gonna just say like. Oh, uh, hi, how's it going? Bye. Did you get the secret tape? Yes, I did get the secret tape. I don't know if I want to spend the extra time to go back to Dalv right now, because I, I want to, I'm like, so close to the end. Yes, hello? Uh, is that male whale with my package? Skip the rhyming and leave it at the door, please. Who's there? I'm in the middle of robbing this nice apartment. <laughs> Come back when I've escaped. I know, I know, I'm being evicted. Slide the notice under the door and I'll add it to the scrapbook. You resist the odd temptation to taste the mop water. Currently on break, admiring the hard day's work. Uh, the Axis letter says, "Wait, hold on. I want I want to have it open when I read this." Okay, so somebody in chat, someone in chat just decoded it, and they said, uh, "I do not know how to send letters. Help me." <laughs> So yeah. Also, apparently there's more dialogue in the shop. My bad. Oh, new. Oh, hold on. Let me grab out some water. <sighs> the lab is located a good distance away from here on level one. It's where the brilliant Dr. Alfie Alfie's conducts important work for the king. I have a theory that some of the weird food in the underground stem from experiments gone awry in that building. Oh yeah? Like what? Ever heard of a thing called instant noodles? It's like a freaking square that turns into edible worms when put in the water. Science gone wrong? Poison? It has to be. Uh, I've heard it's delicious. Have you tried it? Course I have. I ain't afraid of death. <laughs> Sometimes I wish you were. <laughs> anyway, reaching the lab has been a pain lately. A lot of traffic. Almost like something's in the air. Something new. You think? Not much has changed around here in ages. Trust me, I've lived through it all. Uh, you have? Buttons, how old are you? I've seen war bits. <laughs> my god. <laughs> I'm so, I didn't notice he looked at the camera! Huh. Okay, Toriel. Honestly, I don't know how much about the- I don't know much about the former queen. Her whereabouts, how she's doing, all a mystery. Of course, it isn't any of my business anyway, so I haven't properly looked into it. I've seen your stash of gossip magazines! Don't lie to the customer! 
I mean, one gets curious, of course. Uh, eh, that's all, really. Hey, I love reading them as much as you do. Stuff is spicy. Right? Uh, to be a fly on the wall during... Uh, the, um... Uh... Y yeah, I, I do wish Toriel the best. I I'm sure she's made a fine life of herself. Okay. Um... I guess I'll... Monster Candy Plus... Uh, CB Strudel... I guess I'll... Oh, you're carrying too much. Whoops. Uh, I want to be prepared for the end game. Doo doo. Uh. Okay, I think that's good. Hello, and welcome to UG Apartments. The leading establishment where your stay is temporary and unaffordable. Ah, uh, this is just like my apartment complex. I'm the landlord of this complex. Please do not say you find it quite simple. You will be kicked out. How may I be of service, Castle? Of course. To reach new home, you'll want to take the elevator on my left. Not left is in my appearance. Left is in the direction. You get it. Him. Of course, with the core being under maintenance, it is the only way to reach the city. Heavy traffic is expected. Oh, hold on a second. I think I recognize you. Yeah, it's the hat. A blue feathered monster came in here and asked if I would tell you to go to the roof. She wanted to, uh, meet you on the roof, is what she said exactly. Oh, Handlord? Oh, like Landlord with hands. I misread that. Whoops, I've ruined the game. My bad. All I ask is you please do not do anything illegal on the premises. <laughs> I apologize, but we're all out of reservation tonight. A large party of ghosts are here and the rental doesn't know I really love you. Please go back in a few days, please. Oh my gosh, guys! It's 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 at Master Sword Remix. What's up? You enjoying the tune we're currently banging out? Hope you are, cause it's the only one we're playing tonight. No request this time. Sorry, kid. I'm starting to think my date stood me up. I've been waiting here for three hours. The date is tomorrow night. But it wouldn't hurt to show up a little early. The silverware is getting cold. Who oh, am I kidding? My date is so cute. Way out of my league. Why would anyone show up 20 hours early for something like me? <laughs> Sorry! I'm just not cut out for love. <laughs> what is this guy? This has got to be the best restaurant in the underground. Seriously. You can't beat the food, the service, the atmosphere. Something has always puzzled me, though. Where is the kitchen? I must confess, there is one thing about this place that gets me down. The music. Like, this band is fine. A little too new wave for my taste. I miss the acts of my youth. There was this lounge singer they'd host. Beautiful. I mean, wowza. Meow. Sorry. My foot should be out any minute. Can't wait. Ah, Raid. Beautiful droplets from the sky. What produces rain? Is it magic, I wonder? Grandma always said that rain is a manifestation of the underground's heartache. When monsters travel to Waterfall to wish their worries away, those feelings are sucked up into the air and poured out across the land. From old sorrows comes new life in the soil below. If that's the case, some sad monster must have stood in this corner for a long time. As I mentioned, Waterfall is the best place to go to experience rain. Unfortunately, getting there from Hotland isn't super easy right now. 
Have you noticed that? All of the roadblocks scattered about? It's like they don't want anyone venturing off a specific path or something. If you're carrying any rain, don't be shy about releasing it into the air. Holding on to sadness weighs you down. Some people are saying this is small Muffet. I don't know if that's the intent, but it's kind of cute if it is. Because it's also got like the bow. Doesn't, doesn't Muffet also have a bow? The ruler of the underground. Okay, I think I've seen everything that there is to see. The name Metaton appears many, many times. Your destination. You notice a ranking sheet. A winners of the actually magma smoothie challenge. Pyro, fastest time. Grilby, calm and collected. Cinderhead, struggled but finished strong. Heats, something. Ooh, we forgot who this was. Oh, is that the freaking flame guy? Heats McFlame or whatever? I don't know. Starlo was only trying to impress someone. Fuku Fire, most enthusiasm. C no code, transported to a hospital. We might be in legal trouble. All right. People are saying the plant in the bottom left. Okay, I'll check. You guys have never let me down before, unless you count all of those times that you let me down. What the f <laughs> Why are you knocking on a plant, dude? What? What is the <laughs> what is the purpose of this? Why are you knocking on a plant? Your sounds coming from the plants. Audit plant. You can't knock on any of the other plants. Why can you knock on that plant? Okay, I think I should be prepared for the end of the game. I think I should be. But people really want me to go see Dalve, so I'm gonna quickly... I'm just gonna quickly go back. Heats Flamesman, yeah. A bunch of people keep... keep... No, wait, no, I wanna... Dang it, I messed that up. I could've swore it was a bug. It was a bug and they reworked it, I guess? <laughs> Wait, I- oh man, I, I wish I played the original version. What does it do in the original version? Does it just make a knocking noise and that's it? Uh, let's see here. Snowden. It's like the only knockable door in the cyber world in Deltarune. We've arrived without a scratch. The journey was fun, but it's time to dispatch. Okay, where is Dalv? Is he down or up? It's gonna be my last stop before I beat the game. Well, that's Ice Wolf. I, I appreciate the- <gasps> Dalv! Clover! Hello! You sorta of caught me in the middle of moving. But I don't mind taking a break to chat. Uh, what's on your mind? Uh, wh what's up with your housing? Oh, see, this structure here? I've claimed it as my new residency. Of course, it's in no stay for living at the moment. I'll definitely need the help to the reconstruction in the end of things. I'm not sure if Pops will like the close quarters, but... Uh, I'm sure he'll get over it. He has a tendency to get a big head from time to time. We're working on it. I hadn't thought of it up until now, but... We might have a crisis on our hands. Half of my luggage here is stocked with corn. Enough to last a week at most, but what then? I suppose I could trek back, my, back to my field. But still, that'll only get me so far. I don't want to deal with corn withdrawals. Uh, I'll be mulling this over for some time. Uh, don't mind me. So, have you been journeying through the underground? Your bravery is inspiring. The ruins were the only be only the beginning of your obstacles, I'm sure. I uh, do regret troubling you. Very, very much so. But with a glass half full mindset, fighting a low level monster at first was a good training, right? 
There's some pretty scary encounters to be had out there. I'm nothing compared to them. Uh, so please, stay safe. You know, I find it strange. We only met here mere hours ago, but for some reason, it feels like I've known you for years. Time is truly the puzzle we will never solve. Okay. I'm putting this together. That human that Axis killed and took the soul from, is that the human that Dalv met in the underground that we looked like? Because that was another human and he's like, oh, another human. You look like this other human I used to know. I might be guesstimating, but yeah. I want to talk to Pops. Well, better get back to it. I wish you all the luck in the world, Clover. Go do for others what you did for me. Ooh, and for me, I popped. <laughs> I basically helped out move out all by himself. As soon as the exit to Snowden was open, the others bolted. But not me, nope. I'm loyal like that. All right, let's go back now. Now that we've seen Dalv, let's get to the end of the game. And now for the moment you've all been waiting for. And travel, my boy. Um, Hotland, please. What a little guy. We've arrived without a scratch. Blah blah blah, I'm out, bitch. Why did I- why did I ring that again? I don't know why I did that, actually. I just love mail so much. <laughs> Alright, let's, uh, let's go. I'm gonna save, I'm gonna save, just in case, just in case, just in case. <laughs> Axis, go visit Axis. Dang it, guys, we can't do everything. Plus, like, Axis, I don't know where Axis is. That was, like, a really big area. <sighs> I'm gonna let- I'm gonna finish. I'm gonna finish. I'm- I'm not gonna let chat tell me what to do on this one. I, I wanna finish the game. I'm excited. Continue. It's a beautiful day outside. The birds are singing, children are chirping, and and in days like these, cowboys like you should uh, hang out with me. <laughs> what a view! That large facility in front of us is the core. The main source of power for the underground. <laughs> Behind that is new home, the capital city. I asked around and was told Saroba then Starlo headed there. Guess she ran the opposite way of the lab to juke out her pursuer. The two couldn't have gone far. I'm positive we'll find them. We'll, uh... Well, it's all setting in now. This is, like, super intimidating, right? Not just me? I don't know when I'll get another chance, so I'll say it now. You are a kind soul. One of the best I've ever met. Left and right, you've been beaten and bruised, but you stay vigilant. You diffuse situations and mend relationships. A far cry from what I was taught growing up. Royal guards are told at nauseum that humans, they're the enemy. I only ever heard stories of war and underground imprisonment. But you're different. If you could change my mind on humans, 
I know that you can, Asgors. After we defuse the Saroba situation, we'll march right up to that castle, you and me, and then, well, you'll be on your way. But don't worry about me. When Monster Kind is freed, we'll meet again on the surface. By then, you might be all grown up. Wouldn't that be funny? <laughs> Point is, I'm glad you hopped on my raft. Okay, we need to get moving. That way, West New Home. The elevator downstairs should take us straight there. After that, I'm not sure. I'd call for backup in a scenario like this, but you're on your own. And we're on our own. Outlaws. So, partner in crime, you ready? Aww! Man, I am gonna die. I'm gonna be slaughtered? Asgore is gonna take one look at me and then put, put a spear through my chest and murder me. It's gonna go nuts. Let's stop Saroba. After you. Alright, yep, this is very much feeling like the end of the game. Spooky, spooky. Uh... Hold on, I'm just doing an, a last second audio check, just to make sure that the music isn't too loud. We shall see. Okay, the music's actually pretty good, all things considered. Okay. The chat is all spoilers? Okay, then I won't look at the chat. Thank God that was the first message I saw. Guys, please don't uh, post spoilers. Uh, I'm not going to be looking at the chat that much anyway at this point. Uh, but, you know, don't, don't post spoilers. And if you don't want to be spoiled, don't look at chat. Uh, where is the elevator? Oh, here it is. All right. Dude, I am so glad I got to play a great RPG like this and not be spoiled. Love to see it. Whoa! The sprite work goes nuts. A map of your current location sits above the bench. The underground is so much larger than you imagined. <clears throat> okay, so that's where I am. Now, Charles, I know you've had a long day, but if the dishes in the sink aren't done, we can't eat dinner. Uh, can a guy catch a break? They put me in a dock with you all afternoon. I can barely move my fingers, let alone lather them in your weird soap. What's up with that anyway? What's wrong with the soap from the store? I can't even pronounce half the ingredients on that bottle by the sink. You... you can't... Nope, can't do it. I just can't. Are we even at the right station? <laughs> Darn it all. I think we took the wrong elevator. See what happens when I'm stressed? I knew we should have moved to Hotland. Should have trust my gut. This wouldn't have happened with their respectable elevator system. It's interesting. I don't think we've ever seen this area in Undertale, but it's very reminiscent of that, that way, you know, that last, like, major, like, uh, hallway with all of the exposition from the monsters. Huh. It is rather late, isn't it? it? Narrows down the locations they could have gone, at least. Dig around in the bin, find a bottle of sizzling soda. Dig it. Do humans often eat from the garbage? Shoot, I could have left that trash bag out in Snowden as a lure. I'm only joking, of course. I can't judge anyone's culinary preferences after today. Got some adult soda. A 
Adult soda heals question mark, question mark, question mark, HP. Transparent liquid with no so no smell. Oh no. Uh, hallways scare me at the end of video games. Oh, it's the ice cream truck. Oh no, I'm closed. Come back bright and early for a scoop of ice cream. Dang, the sprite work here is crazy, dude. What does this elevator do? I think this elevator goes to the castle. Probably the last place Sorobo would run to. Let's keep searching this area for now. Okay, so odds are I'm gonna have to go back there. Oh, here it is. This is definitely it. This is definitely the area. Yep, the music's off. We're, we're happening. It's happening. I, I see them. This way. Sroba looks distressed. I'm sure we can negotiate from her, her down from this, but... Worst comes to worst. We might have to retreat. Tactically, of course. Let's listen in. Just leave me to my own devices, Star. Saroba, I don't know what you're saying. Please, just calm down. I must go to the lab. It's where Kanako is being kept. It's where Kanako is being kept. I have to get there by any means necessary. I'm not sure that that's a good idea. Don't get in my way. Or what? You'll kill me? I'll... Hey! Clover and I... We watched the tapes. You need to let this go. If not... Why are you here, Clover? You're supposed to be back home! No. Thank you for finding me. Makes things easier. If I were you two... I'd leave Clover here and forget about this. It might not make sense to you, but it's for the best. Cut the self-righteous act, will you? Just stop it. We can turn this around, Saroba. You said it yourself that Kanako is alive. Let's just find her and go back to our normal happy life. Happy life. That's rich. You can make a difference. You can make it right. You can make it better. We don't have to engage in combat. I... Sorry, that was really bad timing. I didn't realize it was about to get super dramatic. I... Lied about Kanako Star. I had to. Yeah. Yeah. What? <laughs> I'm sorry, I just imagined... I just imagined that freaking... That shot from uh, Guardians of the Galaxy 2 where it zooms in on... On a... Uh, freaking uh, Chris Pratt's face and he's like... What? Uh... I accidentally skipped that piece of dialogue. Hold on. I accidentally skipped that. I my finger twitched. I'm I'm going back on stream. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Uh, here we go. I got it. Falling down is practically a death sentence. Unless a miracle takes place at the lab. There's no There's no hope for her. You I'm trying to make the best of what I can, okay? This, this is all I know to do at this point. Kanako, Kanako is a boss monster. She is the key to finishing Chujin's work. 
This is his legacy, his plan for the future. Monster Kind's only hope for survival. Don't you speak for him. You've seen the tapes, right? Do you honestly think this is what he wanted? Kanako wasn't supposed to be a factor in this. If he were here, the Chujin you knew. You knew nothing of him. No, Marley's, Marley's right. He might have had some differing views, but Chujin was kind to everyone. And I know you are as well. It's just that right now, I... I don't understand you. When I fought Clover, I was reckless. But when you went want their soul, it's for the best? Not only Clover's... I didn't even see what that said. What did that, what did that say? Hold on, hold on. Instant playback? Instant playback? What did that say? But when you want their soul, it's for the best. Uh, not only Clover's, but the soul of your own. Okay, yeah, no, he was talking about Kaneko. He was talking about Kaneko. Okay, I was just making sure I didn't want to miss anything. Shut up! Do you think I don't know how far gone I am? And where's this high horse coming from? <laughs> you, it sounds to me like we're in this pit together. Saroba, please. Just get out of here and let me finish what I started. You can't have Clover. We're going to Asgore and that's that. Don't you dare. Marley, grab Clover. I I'll keep Saroba at bay. Go now. Oh, no. Son of a- Oh! Oh, no! Clover. I... I'm sorry for what I've done. I almost wish you never showed up in the Wild East. Maybe then... I could have continued to bury my sorrows in the saloon. But now, I must follow through with my mission. I've somehow grown to respect the hell out of you, but at the end of the day, you're naive. There's so much you don't understand about monsters. What? What did you think? You'd jump down here and find them? Five humans living out their lives unharmed? That isn't how it works. I'm guessing you discovered that truth, right? Then what? What was your and Marley's plan to storm Asgore's castle for revenge? Or was it simply to plead for a free ticket back to the surface? He only needs two more souls to shatter the barrier. Wouldn't hesitate for a second to make that one. But who am I to criticize how he carries out business? Here I am, about to do the very same thing. I'm a hypocrite. A liar, sure. But at least I... With Chujin's guidance, can save countless monster lives. These two couldn't understand that. And Asgore... Asgore's a coward. Didn't believe in my husband at all. Thinks problems will just disappear if he closes the curtains. I long for freedom as much as anyone, but he 
he doesn't consider what will happen once he gets his souls. Everyone else, too. They all believe victory will come easy, but the humans I've heard of? They're powerful. Ruthless. As soon as we try to leave, they will stuff us right back into this hellhole. They want our misery to fester until we give up and die out. I'm no better than Asgore on a scale of morality. I'm... I'm sure of it. What I am is proactive. Monster kind is worth protecting, so I will see that it is done. Truthfully, I have nothing left in my life. So, I've made peace with throwing it all away. You'll fight back, but you can't forever. Goodbye. This seems like it's gonna be a pretty hard fight. Quite frankly, I'm a little bit scared. I don't... I don't think that I could bob my burger this time around. <laughs> no turning back. All right. This is gonna. Go, this fight's gonna go crazy. I just know it. That's right, guys. Bob from Burger. <laughs> uh. Anyway. Uh. Let's, uh, negotiate. You try to talk to Sorova, but her attention is impenetrable. Whoa! Whoa! Oh my god! Oh! This fight's gonna go crazy, isn't it? It's gonna go nuts. That was the first attack? Okay. <laughs> Oopsie poopsie. You take a deep breath. The world seems slow, but only for a moment. Hey, this is a pretty good time to tell everybody that I actually never beat uh, uh, Sans. I never beat Sans on the genocide route of Undertale. I, I don't think I've ever beaten him. Uh, so if this game gets really hard, we might <laughs> we might see a little bit of struggling on my end. Just letting you guys know in advance. Uh, scowl. You look up at Soroba, enraged by what she's done. Oh my god. I'm cooked. I'm cooked. I, I'm cooked. So Rubber wipes sweat from her brow. You what? Yeah, no, I've never beaten Sans. I know, I know. I gotta do it. I'm pretty sure this is a tad harder than Sans. Oh no! Oh my... No, 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 no! Uh, abuse the dodge iframes. Why? Oh, that's what we're doing. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, no! Why won't you die? Oh. Oh. Dang, these these moves are crazy. Why? Nice. Attack 13, defense 15. A legacy not to be forgotten. If I don't succeed, it's over. Wow! 
What? What? Oh my god! Die! Oh! 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 Oh my god! Just die! Uh oh, what is happening? Ah! Uh, I don't like the, the- Oh! What is happening? Oh! Oh! Oh, oh Jesus! What? What? What is she doing? Oh no, she's going sicko mode! Ah! Oh! Ah! Oh, whoa, whoa, what? 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 What is she doing? What is she- oh! Dude, what is happening? So, it's come to this. My last resort. For Chujin. For Kanako. What does the mask do? What, is, what does the mask do? For the future of monster kind! What is- what is happening? What is going on? What is happening? Dude! Oh my god! I need to heal. Oh no, no, I don't need to heal. It fully restored me. Thank Christ. Hey, hey guys. Hey guys, check it out. Mew Mew Love Blaster! <laughs> oh my god! Please stop attacking, please. Oh, whoa, what? It is Mew Mew Love Blaster! There's a dodging ma I was joking! I was joking! I didn't know it was literally Mew Mew Love Blaster! It literally is! It has the shooting mechanic and the dodging mechanic! What? Oh my god! It's okay, this is peak. It's peak! It's peak! The game is peak! We- we've been new, we know this! It's peak! You hold on to your hopes. Defense temporarily increased! It is, it, it is Mew Mew Love Blaster. It literally is. Those sick geniuses. All of those times I've played Mew Mew Love Blaster over and over were to prepare me for this moment. I know how to play already. It's, it's peak. It's peak. You refuse to back down. Gain 7 HP. Uh, mother's love. Remember, you think of those you love most. Speed temporarily increased. There's even the charge shot? Come on, man. You freeze to back down. Gain 9 HP. Oh my god. Endure. I think I can do this in one shot, guys. It's prepared me for this! It's prepared me for this. I got it. 
I got this. What's happening? Your soul pulses with great power. Hope. Oh my god. What? Uh oh. What? What? Me destroying the bells hurts me. Oh, I can dodge it. I oh, I can dodge it. I didn't realize. I can dodge it with, with the B button. Yeah, yeah, I'm doing it. Yeah, yeah. Oh my God, oh my. God. This is this is incredible. This is so cool. What would you like to wear tomorrow, honey? Solomon and Christina are paying a visit and bringing food, too. I'll help you up and we can all enjoy a picnic in the front porch. How's that sound? Saroba. Yes? I don't. <sighs> This is, uh, all so pitiful. Hey, don't say that. We don't need to have anyone over. It could just be us. Uh, picnic sounds lovely. I want you and Kaneko to have one. Surrounded by your closest friends. What are you saying? I, uh... Gosh, um... You know... I never was afraid of it all my life, but... Now... Now that it's so close... No. Shut up! Stop it! Shut up! Shut the fuck up! Say it like it is, or don't say anything. I can't do this. Not now. I'm... I'm, I'm sorry. There's something I must tell you. My work. We never talked about it much, did we? We... we didn't. When I built this house, I installed a basement. What? The entrance is under the Kodatsu. Always has been. There, I work towards a project. Something much bigger than myself. Bigger than all of us. I... I don't understand. I recorded a message for you. When I'm gone, I would like for you to view it. Will you do that for me? I will. I promise you, I will. I haven't seen tears from you since we met at the crossing. I saved them for the moments that matter. I'm... I'm glad. Because this moment matters a lot to me. Goes outside the door. Oh no! Oh, this is so traumatizing. Why? Why would you do this? What? What was that? Were you in my head just now? You have no right. Oh, no! Saroba's shaken by the memory. Oh, this is about to go crazy. Remember. Oh my god. Oh. Oh my god. No, I can't lose now. I can't lose now. 
I refuse to back down. Uh oh. Oh my god. Oh! I'm gonna <laughs> eat some items right now. I can I can dodge uh, out of pretty much anything. Okay. God, how much am I gonna have to do? Okay. Oh my god! <laughs> Holy crap! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Oh man, I am. I'm running out of items. Come on, 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 come on. Dang it! Endure. Okay. A mother's love. Remember. I want a defense. I keep forgetting that uh, Mother's Love is not defense, or Remember is not defense. Oh my god. Okay, endure. Some of the attack combinations are pretty brutal. Yeah. Come on, come on, come on. Yes! Remember! This reminds me of the time that I uh, watched those tapes that my husband made in the basement. Our little girl, Kaneko, she needs to have a, she needs to live a happy life, unaffected by my endeavors. That is my final wish. No, Kaneko watched the tapes. Because Kaneko overheard! Oh my god, I didn't even think of that! Kaneko? Uh... What are you doing down here? Is... Is it true? Uh, uh... What? What? Am I... Different? Uh... Kaneko, I... Daddy said he would've lived a long time if I wasn't here. He would still be... No, 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 no. Your father loved you. And he didn't want to put you in any danger. You heard him. His dream. All those books and papers. You've been trying to finish it, haven't you? With my limited abilities, yes. But it doesn't involve you. I've been looking into ways to create the serum without a boss monster. I'll... I'll figure it out. I have to. But... I found this in the trash. Huh? You figured it out. Last week. I... Using the leftover ex extract from the human soul, I believe I've removed any corruption it held. Negating the need for someone pure of heart, yes. So you did it. Daddy's wish could come true, right? We could make him smile, make him proud of us. But he didn't want you to be a part of this, and, and I agree. Let me do it. I want to make things right, be useful for once. And I trust you to keep me safe. I, I do believe that the refined method would work. I just... Please, you promised you would make his dream come true. I did. Very well. But I'll make it quick. 
I'll ensure your safety throughout the procedure, all right? Mm-hmm. We'll be the heroes of the underground. All thanks to you and Daddy. <laughs> heroes. Huh? That has a nice ring to it. Okay. Wait here. No, don't show us it happening. No, 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 don't do it, 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 don't do it. You'll need to stand very still for this. Close your eyes, and I'll begin the fusion extraction. You may feel a pinch or two, but it'll be over before you know it. Understood? Understood. You truly believe in this, don't you? Yeah. No, 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 no. I don't like this at all. Love you lots. Love you more. Oh my <gasps> Oh The soul became blue Yeah <laughs> you're blue now <laughs> Oh no 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 Oh no 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 no! Wait 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 wait! Wait 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 wait! Why didn't it work? Kanako, wake up! Wake up right now! Mommy's here. Come on. Hey. What? What have I done? You see, when you're blue, you have to, like, stay still so the attacks don't hit you. I learned this from a skeleton. So, you know the truth now. Are you satisfied? Do you find joy in making me relive my darkest memories? I never claimed to be a saint. I'm drowning in a sea of mistakes like anyone else. But instead of sinking, I'm chasing the one ray of sunlight peeking through the surface. I tried letting go, moving on. But I guess deep down, I'm too stubborn to live like that. This is my fate. Oh my god, her eyes. This is how it must be. All right, let's go. You hold on to your hopes. Horrible shot. Oh. 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 <laughs> Soroba is shaken by the memory. Hold on to my hopes. Oh my god. Oh. Oh! Endure. Oh my god. Jeez, oh, dude, I'm running out of items. <laughs> this music goes crazy, though. Oh. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Spam. Spam. Endure.
Mother's love. Oh my god. Oh, all right. All right, we're almost there. God, my my palms are so sweaty. Ah. Uh, endure. Oh my god, yeah, it is hopes and dreams. Oh my god. Almost there. Wait. A mother's love? I thought it said something else. I refuse to back down. Let's finish this. This has got to be it, right? Wait, what? Let's charge it. That's got to be it. It has to be. My love, my child, all gone. Why? Why wouldn't you just? I swore I had the key. Saving monster kind from their demise, carrying on his legacy. It was worth the risk to me. But now, now my life is over for nothing for no one i have done unforgivable things i let my husband work himself to death put my precious little girl through hell and oh god star Orlay. All for a chance to make a difference. A chance. I don't... I don't think I can bear this weight any longer. You won this battle. Do what needs to be done. So... I have the opportunity to do the funniest thing right now. I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm, <laughs> can you imagine? Can you imagine? Can you imagine? <laughs> what are you waiting for? Please, just give me this. Why? Are you like this? Always taking the high road. Aren't you angry? Aren't you just... Pull the trigger already! Pull it! Why? Saroba. You... Beat me up pretty badly, huh? Star, I don't sweat it too much. I reckon I deserved it for the Wild East fiasco. Heck of a... Heck of a hit, though. Uh, I didn't know you had it in you. I'm... I'm so sorry. Everybody's okay. It's all right, everybody. It's all right. It's all right. This truly was an Undertale Yellow Pacifist run. What? Where am I? G Glover, we we gotta get out of here. No, it's it's finished. Clover, over one. Y'all had a fight? It, it, and the deputy won? My lessons worked. 
Well, wait, uh, how much did I miss? I... I don't know what to do. Apologize, make excuses, nothing would change reality. I've dug a hole far too deep to climb out of. And... And for nothing. Hey. Where was I a few hours ago? In this same situation. My judgment was clouded and I screwed up. But you forgave me. The four others did as well. We've both made poor choices. No sugarcoating that. But there is hope. At least, I believe there is. I can't even begin to grasp what you've gone through. But this was an absolutely horrible way of dealing with it. <sighs> yeah, Saroba, you really fucked this one up. <laughs> you can't change what has happened. You're right. But you can control how you live from now on. Your actions will mean everything. But... Jinjin... His legacy... His wish... It'll never be fulfilled. Jujin might not have been the perfect monster I thought he was. But even his darkest secrets came from a caring place. And that, that right there, is his legacy. It isn't found in a serum to save the world. Everyone he helped, everything he crafted, that's what matters. Marley's right. He made life down here bearable for so many. And for that, he has my respect. I, I never... Never thought about it like that. What the hell was I thinking? I was so tunnel vision, so lost. We can work through this. We're here for you. Now, you should take some time to heal. Recoup. But Kanako's well-being is still a valid concern. I have connections to the royal scientists, so I'll begin an investigation. To try my best to help. I... I don't know what to say. Thank you, Marley. Clover, I owe an apology to you, most of all. Our time in the Steamworks and what I said, it wasn't fake. It did allow me to briefly forget my troubles and have fun. But my reasoning for being there do it, do it, Clover, do it, Clover, yes! Yeah! The power of friendship prevails! Why? I mean... Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm... I'm gonna cry. I can't believe it's come to this, but Clover, I think your journey is at its end. Asgore and the barrier await us. No, already? As sad as it is, Clover needs to go home. That 
won't work. W what? Sure, we know Clover for who they are, but Asgore... He won't see Clover though, as we do. He won't see Clover as we do. And he doesn't care to learn. But this is a unique situation. The king has always been kind and understanding. Yeah, Clover wouldn't hurt anyone. You think that's ever mattered in the past? The truth stings, but it is what it is. So, what? Should I take Clover back to Snowden? Hide out for the rest of our lives? Uh, yeah, <laughs> why couldn't Clover stay with us? I mean, it's plausible, but won't the Royal Guard be on the hunt? After so many encounters, Clover just disappears? It wouldn't be the first time. Oh yeah, they would probably think the same thing happened again. Oh my god! Oh my god! Is that implying? Is that implying that that human that that they never the the human soul that they got that Chujin got from Axis uh it, it never got returned to Asgore? That missing human that that like I guess might must have like fused with Axis never got turned to Asgore and nobody knows except for like ah uh, oh my god. But what about the others? You know, the next humans? Clover gets to live happily, but they have to die? Oh. We... we don't know their hearts. Maybe they... what? Deserve it? Have you learned anything? I'm just weighing our options. We're backed into a corner here, all right? Hey, calm down, guys. You know, I really thought tonight's fiasco was enough. We talked it all through and things were going well, but you immediately suggested giving up the future of children to- What is happening? What is hap- Clover? Clover? What? Is Clover just gonna leave while they're talking? You probably want to go home, don't you? Humanity already won by trapping us down here, yet they keep twisting the knife. This cannot continue any longer. You, you must have places to go, correct? The castle, the barrier. I did everything in my power to entertain, so monsters wouldn't have to worry about being stuck down here. Anyway, we'll bypass the Royal Guard and plead your case to Asgore. Remember your real mission, Clover. Asgore only needs two more souls to shatter the barrier. What a world it would be if I had two whole friends. Most might act cheerful, but life down here, it's hopeless. The five children you set out to find in this place? Despite it ups and downs, our little adventure was a blast. Asgore's still out there threatening human lives. I must thank you for opening my eyes. Keep your head in the game! Turns out, you're a pretty damn good leader, Clover. Come on, Clover! You're a kind soul, one of the best I've met. Clover! 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 What are you doing? Uh, hey, uh... C Clover? What's going on? You're scaring us here. Is Clo- What? Well, no, no, no! What? It's time. What, what does that mean? It's time to go. No. No, 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 no. We'll, we'll, we'll think of a plan. We have options. Yeah, 
Don't do something you'll regret. If it's snowed and you don't like, you can live with me. Uh, my house has the space, and the posse loves you. Please, you gotta listen to us, Clover. You deserve better. You're... You're serious. I understand. Saroba. This whole time. What have we been doing? Dragging Clover around, pulling at a leash. Selfish. Clover came here by their own volition. They deserve to leave by it too. But... But you don't want this outcome, right? Surely... If there was another way... But let's face it, there isn't. I believe Clover realized that a long time ago. I... I don't know what to say. As much as I want to stop you, I see it in your eyes. This is about our freedom, isn't it? Oh my god. Oh! <laughs> Clover, you are the bravest, most selfless human I've ever met. Of course, I, I've only met one. But if I ever meet another, I hope they're just like you. I'd promote you to Sheriff. I'd promote you to Sheriff, because Lord knows you've earned it. But you aren't Sheriff material. You're much more. I already made my feelings known in Hotland, so... I'm gonna die. I'm dying right now. I'm sobbing. I'm shitting. Uh, violently vomiting all over the floor. Psst. <sighs> yeah, get on- get in on this, Saroba. Yeah! This means more to us than you know. To- To everyone. It's so Clover, guys. <laughs> guys! It's so Clover! Well... I understand if you two don't want to be here for, uh... You know. Do you have what you need? I do. Guess, uh... Sun's getting low. I'll... See you around, partner. No! Stop! Stop! No, he's giving his gun back! No! No! You got a receipt for that? Thanks, kid. Goodbye, Clover. You've changed my life. Truly. No! Don't give a hat! No! Oh! Oh! I hate this! I hate this game so much! No! Oh, no! Oh, my God. I'm actually starting to cry. Fuck! Ah! Fuck you, Undertale developers! I mean, Undertale Yellow. Fuck you, Undertale Yellow developers! God damn it! Fuck! Ah! Huh. How will I know you're a human now, huh? Stop! Stop! <laughs> halt! This means a lot. I'm sorry the world is like this, but people like you make it better. Thank you. He's no longer Gun Hat. He has no name. He's just a boy. 
or or a, or, or, or a girl or, or a non-binary person. The point is, he's just a fucking dude. Salty, I just joined, but in case you haven't noticed, you are no longer a cowboy. <laughs> I got my cowboy shit taken away. What the fuck? Undertale, the only developer, patch the game. We'll, uh, we'll be outside. You've gained my respect. I mean it. No, no, they're not going to do it right here. They're not going to do it right here, are they? Oh, my God. Oh, my God, they did. Oh! <gasps> Why? Do no. What? Do you want me to stay? Go on. I'll be okay. Very well. This, this won't be forgotten. Goodbye, Clover. No, don't show me it. No. <laughs> Why? 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 So, this is it. All that work just to become another cog in life. <laughs> you've grown so predictable. I could undo all this right now, but maybe you've earned your rest. After all, there's always another. Can't say it's been fun, so I guess this is where we part ways. No, <laughs> who am I kidding? Until we meet again, friend. I am freaking the hell out. I didn't realize it was going to end that soon. I thought there was going to be like, oh, like maybe a scene with Asgore and it'll happen like off screen. Nah, they just killed that motherfucker right on screen. He's dead. Jesus Christ. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. God, dude, fuck. <laughs> oh. No, don't, uh, don't show me more. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> oh my God. This was, this was truly like a journey. Oh my, I just, I'm like speechless. And Toriel is none the wiser of what has occurred on this day. Dalve, Dalve, yeah! Yeah, Dalve time, baby. God. I just like, I can't, I cannot believe how good that game was. Like I am actually like, listen, this entire time I've been saying that the game is good. They really pulled it off. Sh this is shockingly great. Like, I don't want to say shockingly because everybody on the team, so talented, but like for a fan game, for a fan game that is a prequel to Undertale, this this entire thing was amazing. This was so incredible. Oh man.
Oh man, I'm sad. And you know what? You know what sucks about this? This game was so good, I need it to be canon. I need this game to be canon to the original Undertale, and I know it's not. The worst part about this game is that it's a fan game and it's not canon. It's just... Oh, yo! Axis is getting it on with that trash can. I genuinely... I, I you know... It's very rare for people uh, in the industry to acknowledge fan games. I really, really hope that Toby not only sees this, but has the time to play it for Desmond. Like, I, I need, I need Toby to play this at some point. I hope he does, because this is, this was incredible. This was a great, a great time. I've been thinking about that day a lot. Time is a funny thing, you know? I guess in the big picture of my life, you were only a blip. But oftentimes, those blips make the biggest impacts. The king offered me a promotion, a guard post in New Home. But after experiencing the worst job had, but after experiencing the worst the job had to offer, I declined. Not only that, I put in my two weeks. <laughs> I, I felt that there's so many better causes to pour myself into. Anyways. Sorry that I'm putting you on one of my rafts again. Might not be the most appropriate send-off after that last ride, but it's the best tribute I could think of. Uh, it's nice. Yeah. It is. Yeah. Thanks for doing this. Felt good to craft something with meaning again. You got your gift? <laughs> yeah, here you go. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> it looked like he was gonna shoot Marley in the chest! <laughs> what, a, what a mood killer that would have been. Oh shoot, safety's off. <laughs> Damn it! Oh, uh, I almost forgot. There's someone I invited who was a friend of Clover's. A friend? Uh, hello? Is this the right place? Delve! Uh, oh, uh, hello! Howdy! Uh, sorry if I'm intruding. My name is Dalve, and I, um... I was living in the ruins when Clover first entered the underground. So, y you were the first to meet him? One of the first, I suppose. Uh, anyway, um... When we met, I acted foolish and... Attacked Clover. I think we all did at one point. Uh, I promise, it didn't last long, though. Uh, I held back a little, um... Where was I going with this? Clover helped you out of your situation. Yes. All in all, Clover was very kind to me. That checks out. It's nice to meet you, Dalv. Thanks for coming. Of course. Well, no more stalling. Everyone ready? Uh, I believe so. Oh, uh, wait a second. I want to place one more thing. Uh, <laughs> the 
safety glasses? I want Clover to stay safe on their journey. Can't forget him, right? <laughs> no. No, you can't. Yeah, guy, wait a second, where's Blimbino? Yo, where, where's my boy Blimbino? Why, why is Blimbino not at the funeral? There you go. Uh, 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 Goodbye, friend. Uh, Thanks for all you've done. Uh, uh, See you around, kid. Uh, uh, Take care, Clover. Hey there, Delilah, what's it like in New York City? I'm a thousand miles away with your the light. You look so pretty. Yes, you do. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> also, there was an echo flower. Wait, holy shit, that's my name! That's me! I was there! I, yeah, I was there. I was there, guys. I, th that was my name. I was there. I'm in the credits. Oh my god. <laughs> Salty DK Dan jump scare in the in the credits, guys. Man, I will remind everyone: this game is free. You can download it on your computer for free, right now. It's over like eight plus hours of gameplay. And I didn't even get to see everything on this run. There's an entire, there's an entire separate run that I have yet to do. My God. Salty's a main dev on this guy. No, I'm not a main dev. I just did beta testing. I just did beta testing on the earlier segment. Based on the world of Undertale created by Toby Fox and Temi Chang. Wow. We have two separate runs, genocide and neutral. I I think neutral has a different ending. I don't know if it's like a different boss or something. Somebody calls for help. You answer the call. Incredible game. Fan, fan tucking fastic. I just, oh my God. Man. Uh, and it ties into Undertale so well too. Oh my God. Oh man. Oh, this is crazy good. Oh my god. If I ever replay Undertale, I'm not going to be able to see... Oh my god, the game just auto-quit. Oh my god, that was crazy. Oh my god. Zero... Do that game cost zero dollars out of my pocket. Zero freaking dollars. Wow. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. That game was great. Gene was not kidding. That hits different. Well, can't wait to do the genocide route and completely ruin the excellent story that has just made me sob. Get it? Bob sobbing Bob, Bob sob. It rhymes. Yeah, I, I'm going to do the genocide route, but it's, I'm going to be completely real with y'all. 
Um, I kind of don't want to. I kind of don't want to. Oh, wait, what? Wait, hold on, hold on. Well, here we are again, of course. <sighs> There's got to be some way to get what I need. Clover's competent enough, but still. Nothing ever works out when it comes to them. Huh. I could reset and try my luck again. Or... I could accept this outcome and... Wait. The king is only one soul away now. It might be a good idea to piggyback off of the next human instead. But... Who knows how long that'll take. And even worse, if the next human will have the will to do what Clover couldn't. Decisions, decisions. Let me think. Oh. I'm gonna wait. All right. That is an excellent cliffhanger. I am so excited I, I it's like i said i kind of don't want to do the genocide route however the, the uh, first off i'm gonna get the save file uh to do the neutral route first next time i come back to this um i might take just a small break just to stream something else but i will be coming back to this it won't take too long don't worry I'm, i might just do like a filler stream in between just to kind of like detox you know like kind of just you know now that I'm done, I, I don't want to immediately do the genocide, right? You know what I mean? Um, didn't you say you have a save for neutral? I don't have it yet. I don't have it yet. Um, that's up to uh, Colin to send that over to me. Um, however, uh, that will be the next thing I do. And the next thing I do will be the neutral ending. Uh, and then after that, I'm going to do genocide. Uh, like I said... I was kind of I was kind of up in the air if I was going to do neutral and genocide, but I really want to now, if only for just more of these characters and more of this world. And I just know that this is going to tear my heart into this is going to be so upsetting. Uh, so, you know, if you are a viewer and I'm just going to say this now, if you really like this game uh, and don't <laughs> and don't want it to get really hard to watch i imagine that the genocide route is gonna be really difficult to get through uh don't feel any pressure to join us on those streams um however uh yeah i uh, i uh yeah uh here's another there's another ending if you kill saroba what there's like m there's even more endings there's an alternate pacifist ending as well what how many endings are these? Well, I guess, Chad, I guess, I guess it's up to you guys to seek out those, those alternate endings. Hey, you, you know what they say? Download the free video game on the internet and try it out. Kill Saroba real quick. Oh, I don't want to do it right now. Uh, I, I might try it later, but, you know, not right now. I, I want to end here. I'm going to end here for today. Um, I really, really appreciate you guys joining me for this. I, this, the, the wait was worth it. What can I say? Uh, big shout out, big congratulations to the development team. You guys made a fucking banger. This game is crazy. Again, again, I know I've been saying this a lot. This is a free video game that you can buy on the internet that has eight plus hours of content for you to find. And that even more, if you want to like get all of the endings and like uh, talk to like all of the NPCs, I missed out on some stuff. I didn't do everything. I didn't talk and get all of the flavor text. There is so much in this game. Uh, so 100% try it out. Tell the developers online, like what you think of the game, like, Congratulate them on doing such a good fucking job with this. I, I cannot be more impressed. This was worth the wait. I'm so glad that I got to play this. 
Uh, and it almost makes me sad because I've never really played the original Undertale for the channel before. So, like, if people are like, oh, I wonder what he thinks of the original Undertale. I like it. That's all you're going to get. I didn't play the original Undertale on stream. I did that before I did YouTube as like a full time thing. I tried to play it once uh, on, a, on a stream a long time ago, but like I, I couldn't get through it uh, for whatever reason. I, I, I think I, I don't think I was doing well at the time, but that doesn't matter. Uh, eventually, I'd love to do a, a, a stream, a playthrough of Undertale a little bit later. Uh, not right now. Obviously, I'm winding down off of this. Um, but yeah, I, I'm, I'm just going to say it. And, you know, I am a little bit biased because I know a couple of people that worked on this game. Of course, I'm going to admit my bias, but I really do think this is probably one of my, if not my favorite fan game that I've ever played. Uh, and it's like somebody said in chat, if, if people are like, uh, I don't like this game. I'm sorry, man. You're just wrong. It, <laughs> it's good. It's so good. And I, I. By saying this, I know I'm not talking out of my ass with this. Like, I know this is good. Um, but yeah. So yeah, I, I'm going to take a quick break uh, from streams just for the weekend. Uh, I want to get myself uh, together. I have some editing to do on some new videos. Uh, hopefully I can get them out before the end of December. But, you know. Um, yeah. Uh, don't feel pressured to watch the upcoming streams uh, for the alternate endings in Genocide. Don't feel pressured at all. I know that can be a little bit rough for some people. The original Undertale, I played through the genocide route up until Sands. It was rough, man. It made me so sad. Uh, so, yeah. But yeah, that's a good point. If I eventually stream Undertale, I can finally beat Sands. Isn't Undertale Green a fan game? A <laughs> fan game? <laughs> yeah, I can't wait for Undertale Green. Undertale, like what? Like, blue undertale yellow or uh, undertale yellow i just played that game <laughs> anyway <laughs> i'm gonna i'm gonna just uh, uh i'm gonna just uh i'm gonna log off for the night chat thank you for thank you for hanging out and uh and uh, talking to me and uh interacting and enjoying undertale all together like I said, Gene, Gene really popped off with this recommendation. <laughs> I hope you all have a great night. Remember to take your medication, uh, drink water, uh, eat food, preferably burgers, like the one that I'm holding in my hand. And uh, yeah, hope you all have a wonderful night. See ya.